The biggest difficulty with thinking that athletes have is the fear of failure. Competitive athletes are motivated and dedicated people. The desire to win and not to lose is an important part of the self-concept. However, it is important to keep perspective on the desire to win so that it motivates you but does not interfere with your performance. This thinking interferes with performance when it creates tension or anxiety, when it affects your focus or concentration, or when it makes you give up or not try hard enough. So it is important to reframe the way you think about failure and success. Winning does not make you a better person. What you are doing right now makes you a better person because it shows you are willing to do what it takes to be the best that you can be. You are a person who is willing to use whatever tools that are at your disposal to improve. You are willing to look at yourself. You are willing to try. That's what makes you a better person, both in life and in competitive sports. Winning is often a benefit of that type of attitude. The more that you focus on being the best that you can be and make winning a desire rather than a demand, the better you will be. What does that mean to make winning a desire rather than a demand? A demand means that you have to win at all costs in order to feel good about yourself or to be happy. A desire means that you will do what is necessary to strive for your goal, but that your happiness or your feelings about yourself are not based on achieving your goal. Why is this important? Because people who are able to focus on winning as a desire tend to be more persistent in trying to achieve their goal. They don't criticize themselves unnecessarily, but focus on the specific improvements they need to make to attain their goal. Think of yourself as a competitor rather than as a winner. A competitor is someone who strives to win, but doesn't focus on the winning. A competitor uses failures as lessons. Failures are valuable because they give you the opportunity to learn how to be better. Competitors find the opportunity in setbacks. The opportunity is, what can I do to improve? What can I learn from this experience? Competitors know that success does not guarantee happiness and that failure does not need to cause misery. Success is something to enjoy, but failure is also an important part of living. Remind yourself that adversity can build your inner strength, which will make you a better athlete. If you accept failure as a positive force in your life, it can help you develop patience and persistence. Successful people are persistent people. When you have an expectation to win, you set yourself up for failure. Because when you don't meet the expectation, you are less likely to be persistent or to focus on learning.